November 11, the reward of the redeemed. If any man's work abide, he shall receive a reward. 1 Corinthians 3.14 Glorious will be the reward bestowed when the faithful workers gather about the throne of God and of the Lamb. When John in his mortal state beheld the glory of God, he fell as one dead. He was not able to endure the sight, but when the children of God shall have put on immortality, they will see him as he is. 1 John 3, 2. They will stand before the throne accepted in the Beloved. All their sins have been blotted out, all their transgressions borne away. Now they can look upon the undimmed glory of the throne of God. They have been partakers with Christ in his sufferings. They have been workers together with him in the plan of redemption, and they are partakers with him in the joy of seeing souls saved in the kingdom of God, there to praise God through all eternity. In that day the redeemed shall shine forth in the glory of the Father and the Son, the angels touching their golden harps will welcome the king and his trophies of victory. A song of triumph will peal, filling all heaven. Christ is conquered. He enters the heavenly courts, accompanied by his redeemed ones, the witnesses that his mission of suffering and sacrifice has not been in vain. There are homes for the pilgrims of earth. There are robes for the righteous with crowns of glory and palms of victory. All that has perplexed us in the providences of God will in the world to come be made plain. The things hard to be understood will then find explanation. The mysteries of grace will unfold before us. Where our finite minds discovered only confusion and broken promises, we shall see the most perfect and beautiful harmony. We shall know that infinite love ordered the experiences that seemed most trying as we realize the tender care of him who makes all things work together for our good, we shall rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory. I urge you to prepare for the coming of Christ in the clouds of heaven. Prepare for the judgment that when Christ shall come to be admired in all them that believe, you may be among those who will meet him in peace.